Hey y'all, it's All of Destiny and today's video is a little bit of maintenance and self-care. So we'll be trying out a new pedicure kit. Also going to pick up some flowers for myself, doing a little skincare, shower, all of that good stuff. Basically treating yourself the way you want to be treated, okay? All the works. Let's get into it. I said I ain't messing with it unless you real, real fine. <laughs> you feel me? Hey y'all, good morning. How y'all doing? So, I'm getting ready to do my face mask so that I can get in the shower. But I have another package from Clarence. So I want to open it and see what it is just in case I can use the two together. Thank you to Clarence for this, by the way. Ooh, okay. Okay. Total eye lift. Girl, Clarence must not know they already sent me this. Yeah, okay, they sent it to me again. This is the old one, this is the new one. Ooh, I should not open it. I'm gonna give this one away. Wait, is it expired though? 18 months, okay, yeah. This is the Total I Lift in 60 seconds and it has organic, don't play with me. It's got organic that. <laughs> <laughs> it has organic, how are we gonna extract? If you say it like you know what you're talking about, people believe you, I'm telling you. I learned that in communications in college. You just speak with, Confidence. You took tip. <laughs> Cassie flower wax and then plant-based caffeine. The plant-based caffeine visibly reduces the look of dark circles and puffiness. The flower wax tightens and smooths the wrinkles. Okay. And y'all know I'm all about like the anti-aging products because I'm 31. So I try to be proactive, meaning use things that are good for your skin on the front end. So this is the Clarence mask, not sponsored. Um, I am on their PR list, so they do send me things. I've used it a few times. I like it by Teamy, just a little. Hold on, cause I forgot I installed this. I gotta catch up on my videos, cause y'all ain't seen it yet. Look, look. I'm gonna figure out how to show y'all. So this is the Cream Mousse. It's a face mask that helps to relieve puffiness and swelling that's usually caused by stress, heat, or hormonal changes. Following directions, it's recommended to use this one to two times per week as needed. So I'm definitely religiously about to use this in my routine so that I can see how it's working because I've only used it about four times so far, but it's a 10 minute solution to morning puffiness. And I naturally have chubby cheeks and just like a more round full face if you will overall if not for anything else y'all know we just love a good face mask picked up these exfoliating gloves from walmart they come mixed match like this one pink one white and i like them a lot i'm using it in combination with my current favorite wash in the shower the dove cucumber and green tea one it smells so good and since i ran out of my rayel feminine wash i've been given the always want to try y'all it's a light scent, but I like it. My body likes it. <laughs> and I also have this one by uh, Zero Taboos as well that they sent me that I use sometimes, especially on the underarms. To kind of like help with odor and things like that, it helps to remove the deodorant. Followed up with another Dove product since I planned on putting on more Dove afterwards. I just like to kind of use the same line sometimes. None of this video is sponsored, by the way. So then I went ahead and rinsed off the mask. Since it's kind of like a more thick mask, it did take a little minute to get it off. Okay, wait, because look at my jawline looking snatched. What? Do y'all see that? And I'm going to apply the Dove Love Body Lotion. I think this one has shea butter in it. And just put on a little robe and then I proceed to like my work day, which is basically editing, responding to emails, YouTube stuff, you know. <laughs> and then I went ahead and put on the eye mask. I just gently massage that underneath my eyes and then I follow up with my daytime facial moisturizer, which is the MB one. This one does has SPF, which is why I like it for the daytime. It's a really nice formula. Like it's not too greasy, but it does give the skin a nice nourished glow. At home, spa pedicure? Yes, please. If you've ever wondered about my setup behind the scenes, this is what it looks like. I usually just sit in a chair, towel down, and everything else is in front of me. This is the angle that you all get. So I picked up the Bare Luxury Complete Pedicure and Manicure Kit by Morgan Taylor from Sally Beauty. Step one, which is the purifying soak. You get the detox mask. Step three, the sugar scrub. And four, the massage butter. The claims is that you're supposed to get professional results served up in convenient sanitary pouches. This complete service leaves skin glowing with appreciation. Those are the claims, so we're about to find out. So I went ahead and added the soak to the water. And then I soaked following the instructions for about two to five minutes. It does say to towel dry after that. So I didn't do that part, but we're gonna clean underneath. <laughs> we're gonna clean underneath my nails. 
And I did already remove the previous gel polish. If you saw that video, I previously had a white gel pedicure. I didn't remove all of it, but by the time I put the other color on top, you will not even know, okay? And the scent that I have is lavender and sage, by the way. Immediately upon me adding the soap to the water. Oh, baby, it was given. <laughs> the aroma, like my senses, loved it. Let's see if my feet love it too. So after cleaning underneath the nails, I'm using the cuticle pusher to remove the dead skin on the side of the big toe and then usually along the pinky. I basically just gently glide the pusher along the skin and it kind of just lifts it right off. And then I use my finger to rub and feel to see if I feel any more roughness right there. And then after that, I take my buffing block to further smooth out the nails. Listen up, listen up, listen up. If you want with soft feet, baby, listen to me right now, okay? If you don't get anything else from the video, you need a buffing block. This kind right here. So one is a little more abrasive than the other side, and then the white side is more smooth, right? So you wet the block, you wet your foot, and then you massage this, like, go crazy, okay? Like, buff and buff and scrub and scrub and scrub all over. Get every part of the bottom of the foot for soft feet. And I like to keep one of these in my shower as well, even if you don't do your own pedicures and you're just somebody who loves to watch my pedicure videos because the girlies be DMing me telling me that all the time. Definitely in between your pedicure services, like even if I treat myself to a pedicure, please believe this is still going to be in my shower. I'm using this maybe two or three times a week. Now I'm going to take the opposite end of the cuticle pusher and use that to kind of clean up the cuticle area. This helps to remove that dead skin. And the more I soak, I notice that this is an easier process to do. It kind of softens everything up and it basically just kind of comes right off. So next up, I'm going to take step two, which is the detox mask. And you're gonna apply the mask evenly to feet or to the hands. I decided to do both. And then you want to leave the nails bare. After that, it says you're supposed to cleanse and detail the nails and the cuticles, but girl, I had already done this step, my bad. <laughs> But I like this mask a lot. I allowed this to kind of sit. I massaged it in. I put the remainder part on my hands and I like a good mask. Whenever I go to get pedicures and then they wrap your leg in the warm towel, that's the step I'm missing. I should have wrapped my leg in the warm towel. This feels so good. It makes me feel so pampered. And dropped it but yeah we saving all the coin grab it out the water and put it on <laughs> yeah, i'm literally getting this everywhere like in between the toes everywhere to make sure that the mask is all over next time y'all we gotta slice up some fruit in the water we're gonna do like towels and everything i always forget those steps when i'm recording but just going over and beyond if it's extra when you think of it it's like oh that's a lot that's extra do it so this is the part where i had realized that it said to cleanse and detail your toes while the mask is sitting on. So I just went ahead and doubled back and did it again. Why not? It wouldn't hurt. Glad I double checked the instructions because it does say without removing the mask, apply the scrub and massage skin, rinse and towel dry. Glad I saw that because I was about to rinse off the mask before going to step three. Y'all, when I say this felt so good, massaging the scrub in while the mask still on, oh, don't play with me. Don't play with me. Stay with me. <laughs> it felt so good. I'm telling you, top tier. Then, you know me, I got a little curious. I was like, I wonder what it feel like to use the buffing block while the scrub on. It's giving top tier. It's giving out. Not one of them. Y'all see me did the thumbs up, right? Oh, baby, you need this kit. This kit is under $10. Give yourself the full experience. Don't be talking on the phone today and your girlfriend's gossiping while you're doing your little pedicure. Pull up YouTube, type in relaxation, spa radio, something like that, and just let it play. Light a candle. I'm telling you, give yourself the experience that you deserve. This is game changer right here. Yeah. Get into it. <laughs> Look at my toes. They so clean now. What? Step 
step four, which is the massage butter. And I basically massage this into the skin and I also apply this onto my hands and nails as well. And then you can finish off, it says, with the Morgan Taylor nail lacquer. I don't have any of those. So I just also pulled out my gel polishes of choice for the day. I love the massage butter because really you get like more than one use out of this one. I've used this same little pouch about four times. They give you a lot of lotion in that pack. So I'm taking the Madame Glam base gel. Now my press on fell off. <laughs> and then I'm going to apply a thin layer of that to each one of my nails. And I'm going to cure that underneath my UV lamp for two minutes. Remove any of the gel off the skin using a wood stick. And then I'm going to take the ASP gel polish. This one is in orange cream soda. If you saw the previous maintenance video, this is the one we had used on the hands. I was curious, girl, to see how this orange would look on my toes. Because orange is like a color that I love on me. Like clothing wise, orange, yellow, red. Yeah, run me this. <laughs> and you all know I like to use this little pedicure stool. It helps to lift your feet up. Like if you can't reach your feet and you feel like you're bending down too far, I'll link it down below for you all. It's from Amazon. A few of you all come in and said that y'all found it like in a few stores. I like that it holds some of my products as well while I'm working. So I cure for two minutes and then I'm making sure to kind of cap the nail, getting the gel all over. I'm doing about two or three coats, being sure to cure it underneath the UV lamp in between each coat. And then once I'm satisfied with the color, I apply the OPI. This is just a gel top coat, basically to lock in the color and secure like, you know, the entire look. I love the OPI polishes because it's so flat. Like, look at that. And it just glides perfectly to the shape of the toe. Cure for two minutes. I don't have a link to my UV lamp like the most asked question. Let's get into the finished look, baby. Look at the toes. Giving it to the girls. Shameless promo. Sign up for my OnlyFans if you're a guy here. Because the guys be in here too. Don't be mean to them in the comments. This is not a girls only channel. So yeah. Sign up for my OnlyFans. Which I thought I was going to promo everything else and not promo myself. Sign up for my OnlyFans to the guys that are here if you love cute feet. Okay? Yeah. Get into it. Don't judge me. Judge this kit when you try it, love. Because it's really good. Look at the glow. Get into it. Mm-hmm. The link is in the description box, by the way. Hello. Hi. I love this kit. I recommend this kit. It is the fall now, but the feet need to be on point at all times. Even if you don't have OnlyFans, yeah, okay. Look at the glow, get into it. She's that girl. Oh, the heels are Betsy Johnson, by the way. I've had them a while. I may not be able to find them, may not be able to link them, but Miss Betsy Johnson, yeah. The blue bottoms, yeah. Everything will be linked in my description box down below if you all want to start doing your own pedicures. I do have an entire, like, pedicure section on my Amazon storefront. Yeah, I love the orange. You know, a little play on fall. Now let's talk about self-care and treating yourself a little bit more. I'm gonna find the perfect kitchen spot one day. <laughs> I got new flowers from Kroger. I want to start moving my footage to where it's in categories based on content that kind of goes together. Maybe not necessarily in the same day that it happened. So if y'all start seeing my outfits look alike, I might just start categorizing the content. So this bunch, it's really fall like and pretty. It was, it's the fall jumbo palms. This one was $9.99. This little small one. I like flowers to sit on my bath tray sometimes as well. Um, and just in different areas where I am around the house a lot. I'm actually going to start sitting them in my desk where I edit too. Because that's another spot where I'm like it a lot. That way I can appreciate and enjoy them. And flowers is like an inexpensive way to like treat yourself. It's also cute decor around the house. And you don't necessarily have to wait on people to buy you flowers. A lot of the vases that I have is because I do get flower deliveries here and there. If you like flowers, you shouldn't only receive them when they're a gift. So that's why I purchase flowers for myself. And not only that, like I said, I like the look of them around the house as decor. It may sound crazy to some people, but to me, just like looking at them and seeing them kind of makes me happy. The delivery ones, if you can take good care of them, I noticed that they last about two weeks. If you want to try to start getting into flowers and you don't think you would take good care of them, start in the clearest section. These may not last like two full weeks, but if I get one week out of these for $3.49, I would be satisfied. Yeah, and they still come with like the food and everything. I just pick different colors that I like. Whatever would make you happy, like that's the point, right? So choose the one that you like. Like don't overthink it for what somebody else likes, what looks cute to someone else because it's about treating yourself to it. Now, I was surprised to get this big bunch for $5.99. What? You don't have to spend like a lot to treat yourself on things. I think sometimes that's like a misconception. 
uh, with our vlogs when y'all watch, then maybe things have to cost a lot for people to like it. Like that's why I think people make fun of me sometimes if I get excited over the little things because I'm that kind of little things matter to me type of person to where I just appreciate the beauty of just like things that people would consider simple in life. Like my sister Bo, when she was cracking a joke about that, at church, you hear people say like, thank God for the activity of my limbs. Right now my sister Boone is on crutches and she we was like cracking a joke about it in the sense of saying like we hear people get up and testify a thanks for that and until you're on crutches or something you don't realize the importance of that even being somebody's appreciation to God. Not in the sense of saying she didn't appreciate it. I hate having to clarify everything but I think y'all get what I mean about us saying it like wow like I didn't realize. Even like if, the, if it's like a storm and the power go out for a second or something you like, I wasn't really appreciating my electricity and now that it's gone, <laughs> I ain't charging up my phone. Like, <laughs> so like that, basically, if that makes sense. So let's pick out some. Um, and if you get flowers too, keep your laces, cause yeah. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna use this for one. Um, I could take maybe just two or three and put it in here and even doing something like that would help me to spread them around the house. Girl, now you can't reach that one. That's the one I need. I gotta get my stool. I'm gonna wash them all. Sometimes I rinse them out and put them away, but they're kind of cloudy. I want them to be super clear because the water is kind of like a gauge for when they need to be changed, basically when it starts looking cloudy. Hello? Oh God, this one didn't come with food. Oh my God, okay. Tell me how to have you seen us It was about five minutes ago When I seen the hottest chick that a young and never seen before I say yo, tell the girls I'm gonna meet up On second time that ain't the way to go I gotta do a game proper Spit it so get it This one's broken Alright, so this is what we have But I'm gonna trim them more Cause I feel like even if I swap the vase They would still look this way Like the first one is finished this is what i have it took me a while to kind of play around with it i like it more trimmed to kind of be a little bit closer to the base than like so far spread out so i trimmed off like quite a bit and i'm gonna have to show y'all on the second one what i did i took some tape basically because i read somewhere that Things are considered beautiful and pleasing to the eye um, because as humans we appreciate symmetry. So I'm about to show y'all how I did it with like the tape and then kind of matching it up so that all of your flowers don't end up in the same spot. Like you got a little bit of each all over basically. So y'all can probably kind of see the tape and you can obviously remove the tape after you finish. Oh, it's cute. <laughs> I like it. I'm out of time. She's out the door, I gotta go for mine. Cause I don't see you. Once you have the tape up there, basically I am, again, I'm not a flower expert. <laughs> so the florist don't come for me. Not in a rude type of way. I am taking each color one at a time and I'm putting it in each quadrant. And I'm trimming that one down. And if I want to trim more then I'll just do that. So yellow is next. And I just put it in each one. This wouldn't take as long if I wasn't recording, but I got the TikTok and Instagram little camera right next to it, so. And then I always take my very last one and I put that directly in the center. I think I'm gonna trim these a little bit more. This is your sign to go and get flowers from Kroger, not sponsored. Or to just treat yourself to flowers in general and put you a cute little bow on it. What? These don't even look like I did this myself. Oh my God. Okay, so now we just got to decide where we want to put them. I'm 
shadow ban on instagram because yeah my live was just ugh. i ordered me a pizza kind of like a date night in i guess so i ordered a pizza and i'm gonna edit and watch a movie and kind of like just stay in tonight since i am behind on my editing i wanted to kind of make it tonight fun eat my little pizza watch a movie do a little editing go back and forth between the two until i go to bed so that this video can go out tomorrow and i can kind of get caught up like at this present moment i'm two weeks behind but yes, I got my pizza right here. <sighs> and it's about to be a what? A good night. <laughs> so I'm gonna start off first with watching some TV and then we're gonna edit. Where's the hey? Room? Hello, hi, good morning. Mm, yeah, I woke up like this. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. So I realized that I didn't conclude the video, and that's what I wanted to come and do real quick just to say that i hope you all enjoyed this one be sure to like share comment and subscribe i'm about to like add this little clip in and then it'll be done i'm currently in dallas so make sure you follow me on instagram because i am posting over there uh so yeah be sure to do something kind for yourself even if it's just getting like a bouquet of flowers or just doing something nice like a 10 minute bath 15 minutes if you normally do 10. <laughs> i hope y'all enjoyed this one and i will talk to you all in my next video i gotta go ahead and get this out y'all know i don't like editing on vacation but the girl is be looking for me and i want to go ahead and post this video because i don't even like my channel to sit still for too long without me posting so yeah i'm like girl you ain't conclude the video so let me add this little clip in i hope y'all enjoy it and i'll talk to you all in my next upload Money and freedom. Money and freedom.